CNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of very pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This is your uh, 11 a.m. update. And at the moment, you've got a mixed bag out there. Nothing new. We've got the Dow down 104 points. The S&P turned just negative. NASDAQ 100 is up 46. Russell's off 15. Semi's up 28. Tranny's up 54. Gold's off a buck. Silver's up 10 pennies. Lights recruit is off 35 cents. Natural gas is up off uh, seven pennies in a 30-year treasury. Print out at 119.23. That's up 12 ticks. Let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We begin with the ES Mini up the left-hand side. On Friday, uh, the ES Mini generated a, a bull sash candle. That confirmed a buy the D point pattern. There's also a new profile that has formed and support is at 54, 55, 65. Actually, the uh, A to B equals CD bottom pattern. Let me just move this down just a tad here. See, that's in the wrong place. And uh, the key level of support is, quite frankly, 54.32.50. Now, this is a bearish structured profile. We should see price rally up into the sell zone of 55.94 to 56.40. That state would be easier to, to um, come to fruition if we continue to see the spot volatile index fall. Right now, it's above its 50-day exponential moving average. The 50 days at 14 bucks. We're trading at 17.07. But on Friday, the rate of change to the downside was below minus 10%. That's typically an initiation move to higher price for the S&P 500. You've got that by the D-point pattern, as I say, that formed on uh, Friday. If we take a look at the NQ, we did not get a bottoming pattern, and it is trying to form a new profile that is above price. That's a bearish signal. That doesn't mean that price won't rally into 19.522 or higher, 19.522 being resistance. If we look at the U.S. dollar index, having a stellar morning, running right up into a potential resistance zone. The resistance zone is the bottom of its uh, weekly profile at 104.52 and the bottom of the daily profile, 104.53. So we'll have to take a look at what's going on in the three primary currency pairs that make up the U.S. dollar index to get a feel whether this is strong resistance or not. In the case of Goldilocks, it's got an A to B equals CD pattern to the downside. It has not come to fruition just yet. 23.76 would be the initial target. Price is trading with inside its profile, so it's got support at 24.17. Uh, Silver is looking for a bullish reversal candle to confirm a Gartley buy pattern. Light speed crude is trading below profile support. A close today below 76.66 would suggest lower price. Natural gas, no bottom here as we speak in the 30-year treasury just a consolidation with inside its uh, profiles out there trading into the sell zone between 119.07 and 120.20 folks stay tuned for the trader's edge show but if you're off this chart during monday have a magical one thanks for joining us we'll look forward to speaking with you again soon take care now